Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we are going to make liquid loading bar on scratch and I am going to show you how it works. So I just need to drag this mouse pointer and it increases its level and the percentage also changes with it. Now let's make it. Draw a container and draw any kind of container. I'll just draw this bubble and now after drawing a container just take any color i'll take white and just fill this whole place with white and make it go back layer and now erase the hole in inside part so that when the waves are behind the sprite we can see it make the sprite a little bit more bigger okay now just erase everything inside now after that go to the wave you have made just pick a like a wave like this and now under the wave you have to like fill the whole part with the same blue color so when the sprite is like moving upwards, we, we will notice that the empty space also coming up with it. So that's why we are keeping this thing. So now let's code it. So first in this area, let's make it go to like zero, zero, X zero, Y zero and we can uh, make it go to front layer, in back layer. It should be front layer. So front layer, layer like that. Now let's program this wave. Wave. So now let's make this wave go up and down. So when green flag click, simply forever just set y to mouse y not mouse x mouse y so it every time goes up and down now let's make the wave move so for that i'll make this wave come front layer so that we can make the wave okay so you can start from here so you can start from here so now what I have to do is just add an like a change x by block a change x by block here With a forever block and a green flag in it like that and now add an if condition so if it's in this position right now so if greater than so if the x position is greater than one 29 129 as the exposition here it should like clone itself go to control take the clone block and now take the sprite and drag it into a new position somewhere here so this new position we can now add another set x and set x here to minus three four zero this position now let's see how that is working 
okay so that's cloning itself now one more thing so when when i start as a clone it should like when i start as a clone it should like also add a forever block and change x by 10 or 4 looks more realistic so under this if so okay my sprite went there so this position is 4 8 1 so we'll duplicate this delete the inner part and just take this and delete that only the difference i have to change here is i have to turn this to 4 8 0 that much and now inside this just simply add delete this clone now let's see how the wave is moving yeah it looks perfect oh that's a problem there and also one more thing take this thing out and okay, just keep it there i'll just duplicate from here and add this here so it will come like that and there's a problem there so what you have to do is just simply change this uh, shape of the sprite by taking this thing and just moving these stuffs to different positions and changing it like that. So now if I change it like this, it won't be a problem. Yeah, that looks perfect. And now let's make the percentage thing. So what I have to do is just I'll just take a new space here. Take some space and add a green flag option. And now to make a new variable, I'll just make a new variable. Percentage of water. So I'll just get the percentage of water. And that's okay. And if you like, I'll just long press on it. Then you'll get these options. And I'll just change it into a large readout. And if you want, you can place it anywhere. I like to put it here. So this is the thing which is going to show the percentage. So now here forever set percentage of water and go to this operators and take this round block and after that add a plus block and a divide block And after that, take this Y position and add it here and add two here and plus 45. This is the code to make it go percentage. So now you can see I'm here, it's kind of zero. Okay, so I'll just put that, okay. So now, the thing is that you can see that it's going below the, it's not going under, like it's going under 0%. So we don't need, need that. So to like change that, add an if block and add a lesser block. So if percentage of water 
is lesser than zero set percentage of water to zero and same 400 duplicate it and keep it down here just add this to the other side and add 100 here and 100 here there now it will stay in zero and it will stay in 100 there and zero here okay now we need to add that percentage symbol. It's easy to do that. Just take the set percentage of water and take this giant banana apple and add it here. Move this a little bit there. And now I'll take this percentage of water here and in the other one, I'll add a percentage. Now, percentage symbol has come there. And that's it. If you like this video, please subscribe and click the bell icon.